Hey, I would say three years ago, uh, I found that the number one complaint as I did uh, meetings with neighbors in basements and backyards was alleys. But as the city of Detroit's blight removal program progresses. We want to stop talking about removing blight. We want to start talking about building beauty. On Wednesday, that beautification mission got a major boost. The city of Detroit announcing $3 million to support the Arts Alleys Project, which will help beautify alleys in five neighborhoods. Uh, we proposed $3 million in the American Rescue Plan Woo! funds. Uh, <laughs> and I was very glad when we did it. The program will allow alleys to be transformed into beautiful community gathering places. So we'll be uh, in each of our five sites we will be working. Um, with our community partners, developing designs with them uh, through this summer, through this fall. One alley is in the process of becoming a gathering place to focus on mental well-being. This alley um, will allow the Manistee Community Treehouse Center to have a space in nature for mental health and mental well-being, which is one of our missions. And it's also ran, will be ran off of solar power. Those who have been advocating for decades to remove blight believe this initiative will help take beautifying Detroit to the next level. We've been uh, in the business of blight remo removal for almost 34 years. And now to be able to really focus on the beautification is really key. Detroiters who want to learn more about the Arts Alleys Project, go to fox2detroit.com. Detroit is beautiful in so many ways. We're just going to help make more. In Detroit, Ingrid Kelly, Fox 2 News.